Love God, love your neighbor. In fact, it's a rule. It's a commandment. Jesus makes it very clear. Does anybody besides me think that's a little odd? <laughs> How can you require somebody to love you? How can you command somebody to love? Yeah, I know, it's puzzling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think about that. <laughs> because the love that God is describing in the life, death, and resurrection, and ascension of Jesus Christ is not our possession. We do not own it. We cannot dispense with it as we wish here or there, withdraw it, when we don't feel like it, give it when we do. We do not own it. Because it is not in the nature of God's love that it's a part of our will, but it is a gift. And the way we receive this gift is by giving it away. Aaron, Anna, have decided to receive that gift that God has already given them, and to which we will be witnesses to. God has given them a gift which they will receive by giving it away, by choosing every day of their lives, in their waking, in their sleeping, rising up and they're laying down. And they're going out and they're coming in. Ah. To give away the gift of God's love to each other. And we are here to witness <laughs> and be present as God blesses this this morning. So, my friends, come on up. In the name of God, in the name of God, I, Anna, I, Aaron. <laughs>